Welcome home bakers to another episode of my YouTube channel, Basic Home Baking by Mirna. Please like and subscribe. Today, our recipe is Kasaba Bibingka. This is a very simple recipe because you're just going to combine all the ingredients together in the bowl and just pour it to our prepared pan. How do you choose your cassava? You buy the fresh ones and the big tubers. When you open your cassava, make sure that it is a creamy white color with no black fine lines. You cut it at the center and then remove the white vein, the thick white vein at the center. And then you grate it. This is a very easy recipe because you are going to combine all the ingredients in one bowl and then pour this into our prepared pan. The prepared pan is lined with banana leaves and then we're going to brush it with star margarine. Usually star margarine is nice for cassava. Line it at the bottom and then brush it and also the sides because it is quite sticky. Okay. If you don't have banana leaves, you can use aluminum foil and then use an 8 by 12 inches rectangular pan, 2 inches in height. What are the ingredients? Four cups of grated cassava, creamy white. Three fourth cup of white sugar. One half cup of margarine or butter. I use one fourth, one fourth star margarine and butter. For I'm using star margarine for a more pinoy taste. Half cup half can of this evaporated milk, half can of condensed because we're going to use the other half for our toppings. This whole pack of coconut milk, one half cup of makapuno string. Actually, you can use shredded young coconut in replacement of this makapuno string. Two eggs, whole eggs, and then one half grated cheese. Okay, we're going to combine our ingredients for cassava bibingka. This is our four cups of grated cassava. And we're going to add two eggs. Three fourth cup of white sugar, we're just going to use this warvis. You should always invest in good quality warvis because in baking you will always use warvis and a good quality spatula. Add one half of this evaporated milk. The other half you're going to use for topping. Add one half of your condensed milk. The other half for topping. One whole pack of gata or one cup of coconut milk. Okay. 
just mix all together. One half cup of grated cheese. Goes in there. Or margarine and butter. Total of one half cup. You can use star margarine if you like. And then, this is the secret. Makapuno. One half of makapuno string. You can use shredded young coconut. Around one half cup. Okay. Then mix. Mix everything. That easy. Mix everything and bake. Use softened butter. So you can mix it easily. We'll bake this for an hour. You check at 30 minutes. Mix until well blended. Then we're going to pour this in our prepared pan. And bake. The oven is preheated at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Put this in the oven for an hour. For the toppings, we're going to combine our ingredients and then cook this in a double boiler. One half pan of evap. One half pan of condensed. Two tablespoon of flour, or purpose flour. Two tablespoon of sugar, and two egg yolks. Combine everything, and then cook in a double boiler. And then we're going to put this on top of our bake. Kasama bibingka. And then bake again for another 15 minutes more. Lastly, we're going to add the makapuno and the cheese. Makapuno and the cheese. Two tablespoons of cheese. Grated cheese. Continuously stirring the mixture until it is thick and creamy.
use the double boiler this is a bowl and under is a casserole with water and then stir continuously This is ready. See. My cassava bibinka is out of the oven. After 50 minutes, and then we're going to pour the topping. Up with cheese. You can mix it. Put makapuno on top. Then bake again for another 15 minutes. Saba is finally out of the oven. Look at that. The top is a brown color. With the mapuno. We let this cool first before we slice and taste. See? Looks so yummy. Now our cake is ready and we can slice, it's now cold, let's try this.
that. Look at that. And the slice. going to taste it. Mm. Okay, let's try our cassava. See how it tastes. Try this at home. There you have it, our cassava bibinka. See you on my next video. Please like and subscribe. And if you have any suggestions, just write your comments and we can consider it on our future episodes. Enjoy!